Wuala. We can name our local account. Hello everybody, you are on Andrew Hello channel. Today I'm going to tell you and show you in detail how to bypass Microsoft account. It's been a while since I released video about Microsoft account. To be correctly, I just make a video about the reason, the common reason why you should not use Microsoft account. So actually you can watch this video here. It is very useful. And today I decide to make video how to bypass Microsoft account because actually many users simply don't know that there is an option to use a local account because Microsoft is quite tricky this year. And if you install a Windows 11, for the example, on your laptop or computer, you may not see option to choose a local account. But don't worry about that. I will show you the three top ultimate ways how to use local account. So definitely there is a lot of reason why you should not use Microsoft account. So you can just use a local account. The common reason why people don't want to use Microsoft account that you need to have access to internet if you want to run your laptop. That's just hilarious. For the example, if you have a laptop, this is your laptop and you already bought a licensed Windows, but you can get access to your computer because you don't have internet. And the main question is, Microsoft, are you kidding me? Your laptop or your computer, it's your property, not Microsoft. So why you should need to ask permission Microsoft to log in to your computer? And also the most importantly that you need to know about Microsoft account that it collect too much data your personal data. So many user not okay with this and I'm also not okay with this. I don't want to share my data, my experience using Microsoft account to improve experience of Microsoft. So the thing is, I just want to turn on my computer and I just want to use it. I don't want to enter Microsoft account. Actually, I'm from Ukraine. We have some problem with internet connection right now. So definitely it's not cool that I will turn my computer and I cannot use it because I don't have internet. So guys, today I'm going to show you three ultimate ways how to bypass Microsoft account and use local account. And for this, you do not need to install some special software and other utilities. You just need to repeat after me. So before this video start, please like it. Definitely don't forget to subscribe to my channel. It will help me a lot. And let's get it started. So guys, as you can see, we are in the window where Microsoft forced us to enter our Microsoft account and someone need to create it. And if you look here, we have option to create one. So create a Microsoft account also we can sign with a security key. So you need to create this key and we have option to sign in option. So if we click here and if we take a close look, we also don't see an option to enter a local account. So we can go back. So guys, right now I'm going to show you the first and probably the easiest way to enter local account. You can just type some random email, phone or Skype. It's not important that it need to be your email, phone or Skype. For the example, I will just type Andri. After that, I will press enter. And now I need to enter the password. But the thing is, you can type anything you want. So we will type the wrong password, for the example, one, two, three, four. And after that, I will click sign in. Whoops, something went wrong. <laughs> so actually, right now, if we click next, we will have option to enter local account. Click next. Wait a few minutes and voila. As you can see, we can name our local account. So please like this video if you agree that this way is totally easy. So actually this is the easiest way 
to enter a local account so you can just name your local account as you wish user and after that you can just click next so guys another time let's talk about the second way to use a local account definitely this way also work in 2023 so right now i will show you how to do this and as you can see we are in the same window but this time we need to do next you need to push shift plus f10 after that you need to type next ip config press the spacebar it's very important to press the spacebar slash release so friends after we type this command it works similar like plugging and unplugging an internet cable so after you enter this command you need to press enter windows ip configuration now you can close this window after this process you need to go back click here and as you can see now you also have option to use a local account everything is very easy you just need to type your username as you wish and click next everything is very simple my friends i want to mention one important thing that right now i'm showing the ways that really work in 2023 but you need to understand that the microsoft it's quite big corporation and probably if they see that user like me making a video how to bypass a microsoft account probably some of these ways in the future may not work but right now in 2023 everything works fine so folks right now i'm going to show you the third way how to bypass microsoft account and use a local account another time you need to push shift plus f10 you need to wait until command prompt will appear on your screen and after that you need to type next ob backslash bypass and row actually this command will help to bypass network requirements and after that your laptop or computer will restart so be sure to type everything correctly as you can see we have two o and press enter my friends now you need to wait until your laptop or computer will restart and then i will show you the next stage of what you need to do to bypass microsoft account and voila right now we see the next message let's connect you to a network and if i move the mouse cursor right here i will see the next message i don't have internet and that's exactly that i need so click here and now we also have two options connect to the internet and continue with limited setup click here so friends finally you can create a local account as you can see the third way also work without any problem nothing complicated here so you can just type user and click next password i don't need a password for the first time you may see some option like location etc and to be honest in most cases i uncheck all of them you also can repeat after me if you wish click accept and we are in the windows so if we find accounts click on it and if you take a close look you may see that i use a local account so guys i think it will be more than enough for today so guys if this video was useful for you please like it and definitely don't forget to subscribe to my channel it will help me a lot also on my channel you can watch a lot of interesting videos and i will be gladful if you watch all of them goodbye everyone see you soon